Hey guys, welcome back to Automotive Stories. Now we are starting this video in my garage because today we have a different kind of video. And it's actually not even 7 a.m. yet, so yeah, pretty dark outside. <laughs> Anyways, uh, today we're gonna do a uh, first vlog actually. And uh, there's quite a bit planned actually. We are actually taking uh, the Suburban out. We have to go to the dealer and uh, we have to get uh, some uh, the lock wheels cap things the screws uh, i lost the key to unlock them so the dealer fortunately has a master key and with those taken off we will be able to see if the new winter tire set fits really nicely on the truck today so that's plan so uh, i'm just gonna head in the car we're gonna continue this intro but before we go anywhere we need to go get a coffee because it is early and I am exhausted. No. Oh my god. Whew. Hasn't been cold like this in a few months. <laughs> okay, so as I said, um, we have to go to the dealer and then we have to go to the tire place. But the most important stop in the entire thing is my morning coffee. So, let's go to Starbucks. Look how cold it is. You see the you see the carbon dioxide coming out of the exhaust through the camera. <laughs> oh my god. Ah anyways, let's carry on. So uh anyways this is a different kind of video, so you guys uh, shall let me know what you think. Um I'll see it's hard to determine when to uh you know record, when not to. And, uh, you know, this is going to be a really fun morning. Hopefully the lighting will get a little better. But, man, it is, uh, this is proof that this is, we're in fall right now. It's, it's 7 a.m. and the sun isn't even out. God. This is actually really, really depressing. You really need to support the channel, okay? I, I don't want to sound cringy or I don't want to be, I don't want any disrespect, okay? But, I mean... The channel, I don't know if you know new YouTube requirements, but if you don't, this is a quick summary. You basically need a thousand subscribers and four thousand watch hours before the end of the year that you've started. So in my case, it would be the 25th of March, 2019. But, and uh, you know, if you want me to continue producing content, not that I will stop, but it helps a lot, supports me, and you know, it makes me know that I'm not doing this for nothing. Anyways, let's order. Oui, bonjour. Est-ce que je peux avoir un venti cappuccino, s'il vous plaît? Oui, ça va être tout. Merci. Parfait. So you guys got to hear me firsthand talking uh, French. 7 a.m. and there's quite a bit of people here. Bonjour, c'est combien? Merci beaucoup. Au revoir. So, got the coffee. We are in business. So, let's go. We got turn left onto Kim and Lucerne. We have quite a bit of drive to do. Let me just turn down the audio because she's. Anyway, so, as I mentioned earlier, we are going to the GMC Chevrolet Buick Corvette dealership, and we are going to ask them to remove the uh, lock bolts, center lock bolts, uh, off the car. Nah, they're going to change them with those I have in the trunk, which I have the key for. So, yes, so we are going back, and then after that, uh, we're going to go to this place, and uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much it. So, I'll uh, see you guys there.
turn right, then your destination will be on the left. So here we are, a Chevy dealership. It's actually quite nice. Pretty early. I think it's only like the surface that's open at this time. So here we are at the dealer. So this should take a little bit, so uh, I'll see you guys soon. This week, I was talking about, we have to take these off and replace them with new ones. So, okay, so the dealer finally finished the job. Cost $86 just to take those things off, so don't lose the key. And uh, we are off to see if the wheels fit perfectly, so here we go. Okay, so we ultimately uh, saw the wheels and that they installed them. They just put the wheel and they said everything was good and everything would fit. So yeah, in about two weeks, we're going to be back and we're going to put the new snow tires and the car's going to be looking good. So now uh, I'm going to try to go wash the car a little bit. So we're going to take it to a car wash and yeah, that's going to be awesome. So now this car will be prepped for winter. Except, you know, it won't have its tires yet. And actually, it's it snowed a little bit this morning. You can see it with the night. But it was a mix of rain and snow. It was nearly zero degrees. So, yeah. But anyways, that's pretty awesome. So, let's go to the car wash and get the car washed, obviously. <laughs> The car is clean. Anyways, let's go home and finish off this video in my driveway. All right, so that's gonna conclude today's video. So we went to the dealer. Sorry, I couldn't film that much. I mean, there was like, they were like, are you filming? I was like, yeah. Like, no, I'm sorry. Just, we prefer not you, that you don't film. So I was like, okay, I won't film. So I didn't film much. I tried to film as much as I could. And then uh, the wheels, I filmed a little bit of the wheels. Um, then again. We're live driving, a lot of driving. My stupid GPS made me cross a bridge. I had to do a whole circle to come back, which was like 30 minutes. Stupid GPS. And yeah, and we bought bacon. Hell yeah, we bought bacon, went through the drive through uh, It was early, it was cold. Surprisingly, it's, it's, it's still the same temperature right now. Um, it's freezing, God, it's freezing. It really, it's ridiculous. Don't move to Canada. Why would you move the camera? It doesn't matter. Just, if you don't like the cold, don't come here. Be don't come to Canada because cold is all we have. And yeah, that was pretty good. So hopefully my stupid camera didn't corrupt everything. I don't know. It's been filming the entire time. I have no idea. Let's hope. Let's cross our fingers. And if it doesn't, I swear to God, I'm bringing it back and I am buying a new one. And I'm going to say screw you guys. So yeah. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I know this was a different video. Uh, so, as I mentioned before in the drive-thru, I'm trying my best here to do great content. I know this is the first vlog, so it might be ups and downs. I'll see how things are when I edit. And, uh, you know, uh, they'll get better as soon as they come. And I would really appreciate that you like and subscribe the video. Um, YouTube has new re recommendations, new, you know new averages to accept new uh, new things to achieve i need a thousand subscribers and four thousand watch hours which i'm trying to achieve achieve we're getting there slowly but surely uh, but you know it would really fun supporting me will help me greatly and not your own not only helping me you're going to help yourself because if this channel gets more and more supported i love what i do right now but i mean at some point if it doesn't go anywhere i'm gonna have to um, think about you know stopping but if you guys like what i do show it by liking and subscribing and the more i see that the better it's going to be for me 
for you because it's going to encourage me to continue to be able to buy more equipment film more cars you know be able to have more time to do stuff like this better videos are going to be made and so on so more we su support me you support yourself in a weird way but you know comment down below what you love about the Chevrolet Suburban because I have a feeling we're not going to see it for a while on the channel. I say that, but you know, I've been I've been driving it for like a week now and uh, I, I, that poor Civic over there has been there for like a week and a half. Has not moved? I'm sorry. Anyways, uh, take care guys. I really appreciate you watching until the end if you are watching till the end unless I'm just talking to myself. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe as I said, for the millionth time. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. All right, take care, guys.